Yo. Hello and welcome to another Synfig tutorial and uh, I believe this one will be a very quick one. Um, so today I'm going to show you how to vectorize um, a bitmap image using Synfig. Right, so this feature was added with the latest update. So yeah, let's get right into it. So I'm just going to import an image. Alright, so here we have a horrible drawing right here. Um, and this is all bitmap, right? As you can see, um, it opened up with, you know, its own folder here. And if you look inside, let me see if I can open it. Okay, it won't allow me to open it because of uh, my recording software that I'm using. It, that It does that sometimes. But uh, if we zoom in, right, we can see that it's a bitmap image, okay? So, to vectorize this image, just right click, click on convert to vector. Then you'll be presented with these settings. And I'm not going to pretend to know what all of these does, okay? Because I haven't yet explored them um, to, to a T. But um, we, we'll just leave the default settings here for now and click on convert. And depending on the size of your image, it will take a while. So, you know, let's go for some coffee or some tea, uh, maybe a sandwich. Okay, and it's done. <laughs> so let me turn off my image layer. So if we zoom in, we can see that it has done a pretty, pretty fine job, if I must say. Of course, it's not perfect, right? But it's looking pretty good. And uh, if we click on these lines, we can see that they're made up of um, points, right? And you can pretty much you can edit them if you if you wish. You know, you can right click and remove points um, as you would if you created the the lines on your own, right? Um, so within the folder, we can see that there are tons of outline outline layers, right? So this is what Synfig used to create the our vector image right here right and if you know you don't like to have so many layers uh let me just remind you that if you are using for example a commercial program like illustrator i'm pretty sure you'd have as many layers as this or even more okay so so this is normal for for vector um images all right um so yeah and you can uh, scale in scale out and as you see as you can see it won't lose quality right and uh you could even um save this out and print it on a t-shirt uh so i can increase my canvas size now so let's say maybe four thousand by four thousand right if you needed the image to be bigger apply okay and again no quality is lost right so that is pretty cool Right, and uh, if you want to know more about this tool, you can check out the release notes um, again. Um, that the release notes for Synfig 1.4, and I'll link that again in the description below. So, I hope you enjoyed this video, and I will see you in the next one. Yeah, okay.